Good morning, good morning. Welcome to my abode in uh, six in the morning fall camp. Let's do it. Well, uh, so this is my closet. <laughs> I got about, not that many clothes surprisingly, but it's all right. And then I got my shoes in there, my dresser from 1934, like this dresser. <laughs> They say you can save over like a hundred, some crazy, a hundred gallons of water or something by not leaving the water on while you brush your teeth. Dirty clothes, love my bed. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Long board, can't do that anymore since we're in the season. <laughs> yeah, this is my room. It's not too bad. Oh, posters. Michael Jordan, he's the man. Muhammad Ali, Steve Ray Vaughn, and then we got Einstein. Ain't last night. Good, really good. It's probably why I slept so good last night. I'm really excited for the season. It's, <laughs> you know, this is what you do it all for. You get all the practices, all the running, all the lifting weights. You do it so you can play the actual football game. So I'm ecstatic to play. You know, it's a lot more relaxed. It's a lot more relaxed feeling around like the facility and the, the rack. Because, you know, we don't have to, we feel like you can kind of like calm down and, and our coaches are have our best interest in, and we feel like we're going in the right direction. So with all that, you, you just want to, you just want to be there. You want to win. You want to compete. So. Getting breakfast, most important, most important meal of the day. And as Coach Duvall said, you got to put something in the tank to get something out. May I have some uh, eggs and hash browns, please? Now this is my favorite part, because I love the yogurt. Literally love it. And as you can see, my teammates love it too, because there's almost none left. You know these glass wind windshields are supposed to like work, like so you don't you can like look over, but it doesn't really work for people over six foot. Oh, nutrition is a big, big deal this year because you know we have to we have to keep our, our body fats down and. And at the same time, just want to be the best athlete we can be. And with that comes Coach Duvall and like his nutrition. So a lot of this stuff, last year we'd be getting like pancakes and Pop-Tarts for breakfast. Now we're eating like actually like healthy for breakfast. So, well, it's time to eat some breakfast now and I'll, I'll see you over at the rack. Something we'll get taped. Put some tape on my ankles and on my wrist. Good morning. Eddie, Eddie. Good morning, RP. You know what's a bad thing, RP? When you wake up in the middle of the night, like use the bathroom and you stub your toe on the corner of a door. Oh. Yep. And you think that like <laughs> you just paralyze yourself. It's like, oh, I can't feel my legs. Yeah. Because it's still like my apartment's still like fairly new, so I don't know my surroundings like like the back of my hand yet. So maybe I feel like this door is two more inches to the left than it actually like really is. You gotta believe. Believe! Yes. First try. Today's a good day. I, I can already tell that's Dominic Roof ran. Me and Dom went to Vegas together. It's a good time. It was fun. We went to like, went to a whole bunch of shows. I fake got hypnotized. <laughs> I have the whole DVD. <laughs> Time to go into meetings. I'll see you guys later. The reason why we did it over is he was wrong. Okay, listen now. Yep. It goes back to your base rules. At the end of the day, Jordan, doesn't matter what they do, it's about what we do. Okay. okay. And shoot, if he recalled it and he was wrong, but we all do it together, are we right? Yep. 11 guys doing something wrong is 11 guys doing something right. So yeah. you're going to get the same page here. All right, I'm about to go put my pads on, strap it up. I'll see you guys in a minute.
Is it Tempur-Pedic? Is that a Tempur-Pedic? Is that a Tempur-Pedic bad man? We're meeting in the summer. Was he wearing a Yankees hat or an A's hat? A's. Oh, that's my West Coast team. He said something like that, right? <laughs> I like two teams in the same division. It happens. You tell me what league they're in. First of all, it's not division. Right? <laughs> I'm locked in. I, I gotta. Oh, you folks on yeah, football? Yeah, yeah, I'm locked. Like I'm locked in. Right. Boom! <laughs> One week out from starting, you know, your your game week type preparations and stuff. Is it that kind of that time where you're starting to kind of see the finish line and uh, be able to look forward a little bit to the opener? Well, you know, uh, we're our coaching staff and stuff. We always are taught to take it one day at a time. So. Yeah, even though out of your peripheral vision, you can see the finish line, we're still just taking it one day at a time and one practice, one rep, and trying to get better every day. Being able to play football and actually play the game is what we do for. We love playing the game of football, and tomorrow we actually get to do that. So, you know, uh, it's going to be a, a big deal to actually get that done, but at the same time, you know, we're, we're going we're gonna to be all right. Ooh, and we're off. I'm going to get some uh, lunch and take a break and refuel a little bit and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Back from lunch, time to go do it all over again. Here we go. Let's go get tape. So, just got done uh, going over some film, watching some plays from the first practice today. Got to go get finished getting taped and get ready for the second one. Honestly, body and mentally, you just got to, it's so demanding and taxing just to do it once and then do it again. You got to really find yourself, like find another gear and, and find a way to, to really thrive in it because you just don't want to survive your two day. You want to actually thrive and get better. So, I just say you have to find that mindset and find that gear to get it done. I wish they let me play both ways here, but they don't let me. I love play tight and score a touchdown. Come on. Wasn't my best ball. Yeah, man, you know, today was a good day. A solid two practices. Felt like we got better as a team, as a unit. So, you know, I'm, I'm happy with what we did with the day. So it's going good. I'm going to go ahead and get some, get some grub, get some dinner. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be great. Oh, got to get some, some veggies, especially since I'm on camera, so I'll make my mother proud. Man, what an honor to have you sitting with us. It's great playing next to this We guy. love Eddie Arnold. He's a good guy. He's a great, guy. great man, Eddie Arnold. You're the best, Eddie. I look up to you so much. Thanks. He's a great guy. Thanks, guys. <laughs> if I could wake up and beat anybody, it'd be Eddie. Absolutely. Eddie and Eddie. Say, it's winding down. It's 8, 8, 10. Pretty much the conclusion of a two a day. It's been a grind all day, you know, we gotta grind through it, grind, 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 but you know, it's uh, going into camp, it's like sharpening a blade. Sharpening a blade, you just gotta, each day you gotta keep getting sharper and sharper, and hopefully when we get into this season, we'll be, we'll be a samurai so and cut some stuff up, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna be all right. Man, I'm so just excited for the first game. Got a great opponent, Montana, coming down here to, to, to see what we got. It's an old, it's really actually an old school rivalry. Get to get to uh, renew a little old school rivalry there, a little tradition. And I'm just excited to play. Getting, you know, you know, you get your bangs and bruises and stuff, but none of that, none of that is outweighed by the fact that we get to play our first game here soon. And that's all it is right there. Well, people, Wyoming community, and Wyoming followers. It's been a great long day. It's time to hit the hay though, so I'm gonna get some sleep for this scrimmage tomorrow and I appreciate you guys hanging out with me today. You guys have a good one. Can't forget my keys.